thing. Don't forget, today is also Arizona Gives Day. Let's take a look. Wednesday? No. In addition, it's Arizona Gives Day. Gives what and to whom? <laughs> Larissa Tyson, welcome to the Morning Scramble. Explain this. Thank you, Pat, for the opportunity. I mean, Arizona Gives Day, this is the second year that we have sponsored this event. It's an opportunity, a 24-hour online giving event um, statewide. And Arizonans are invited to basically contribute, go online, find a nonprofit that they are um, enamored of or one that they've been working with or one they don't even know about yet. They can go online, search by zip code, by type of nonprofit, find one they want, make a contribution, um, and they're done with it. It takes about two minutes. So it's already started because if you're talking about 24 hours and this is Arizona Gives Day, it began at midnight? It began at midnight, and I'll admit I was up at 4 o'clock in the morning checking to see the leaderboards, because if you go to azgives.org, you can see the results that are continuously being updated. And but it's a terrific idea, and there's so many people who are generous in this community and across the state, but a lot of times they just simply don't know uh, who might be a worthy charity that needs their help, but you've got a thousand listed. Yes. How, how do I pick one? Well, if you're already a donor, you're for sure finding your email box flooded with uh, requests from those uh, your favorite charity saying, go online, today's Arizona Gives Day, and you click, click, click the link in their email and you go directly to their landing but page. But what if I don't know? This is my first day. If it's your first day, maybe you say, I love animals and I'd like to find an animal shelter in oh. my zip code. You can go in and you can type in your zip code and the type of charity you want and you'll be taken to a list of nonprofits and you can choose the one that appeals to you. It seems like it would be almost infinite as far as the choices are concerned. Well, 960, almost 1,000, you're absolutely right. It's, it's a large list. And the average donation? The minimum is ten dollars. We'd like to encourage folks to give as much as they can. Our nonprofits need charitable contributions, um, so this is the opportunity to be generous. But ten dollars also uh, is within the reach. It's not so elusive. It's not. Uh, so upscale that it shuts people out. Absolutely. Um, our effort is to democratize uh, charitable giving, philanthropy, so folks don't think it's only about wealthy people who can afford to give. A $10 contribution can make a big difference for a lot of these little nonprofits. Now, you said this is the second year? This is the second year, yes. Marissa, are you free to tell me how you did last year? Oh, absolutely. Um, what we've reported, we made over a million dollars last year. Wow. And our goal is certainly to exceed that this year. So in what area, though? In, in what specific area? Is it all Arizona? All, all over Arizona. Every county has nonprofits participating. We have prize money, which I think is important for folks to know. So if you have a favorite charity, um, they're competing not only for individual donations, but for prize money. So the most donors generated, the most dollars generated. If you're a small nonprofit, there's a leaderboard just for small nonprofits and a leaderboard for rural. Nonprofits. You've probably already been warned by the staff that I'm a slow <laughs> learner. So just take me through the process before we wrap things up okay. here. On Arizona Gives Day, so I sit down at the computer and what? You type in azgives.org. You go to the website, you'll be um, asked to identify search, and you can put in the name of the charity that you want to support or the type of uh, charity, and you'll soon get some uh, guidance in terms of specifically how you want to uh, specify your search. So well, only... we're, we're not only getting guidance oh, from you, All right. but also on the screen Super. for other slow learners like me. So you can see now the uh, most most donors overall, and this will be changing. This is a leaderboard that will be changing throughout the, the course of the day. And this is going on now? This is going on now. So you can see and some of these nonprofits are tiny, uh, and yet they've generated you know hundreds and hundreds of donors already this morning. Marissa Weiss, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for Arizona Gives Day. And, well, wait a minute. Oh, Pat, just 
Just for you, you I'm giving you a sticker, and I hope that you wear it all day long, letting folks know uh, today is Arizona Gifts Day. And people ask you, you got to flip it. It's upside down. Oh. <laughs> Very good. So wear it proudly all day long. Terrific. And right side up. And right side up. Well, it might, they might uh, be curious if it's upside down. They might be more inclined to read it. So. <laughs> and Mar Marissa, you have the heart of a marketer. Thank you. <laughs> Back in just a moment on the morning scramble. Mm -hmm.